stop the hand. We were watching this the other night on uh on No Pants. Remove the shoe. How is it that you know the bar is, is so tag. low? Magino session. The bar is so low. You would think with modern technology it would be very easy for them to surpass the nineties movie. Somehow the Ghana version is better than the twenty twenty one. Bro, this movie goes eight. They go ham in this shit. Mark, you see this whole thing, right? Run. What I want to point out is even the you fight scenes are better in this version. Even the fight scenes. Bro, look at the combat. Look at the combat. <laughs> oh, shit. This is so stupid. <laughs> Yet, this is somehow more compelling than the 2021 movie. That's the crazy part. Better than real NRS animations, and they kept the whoopsie in. <laughs> this shit is godlike, man. You are not fucking with this. How did how did they have million dollar budget for a, for a new Mortal Kombat movie? They not only couldn't beat the first 90s movie, which I rewatched recently, and that shit is awful. That shit is bad. It's worse than you remember. We're not even talking about Annihilation. I'm talking about the first movie. That shit is not good. You, you, they had all the budget in the world to beat that shit. I mean, did you watch the first Mortal Kombat movie again? It's fucking awful. Have you, when's the last time you watched that movie? Bruh, Goro is literally a Chuck E. Cheese, uh, band member you know he's literally just an animatronic for some five nights at freddy's shit and then they beat him he just falls off of a cliff it's, it's the stupidest shit on earth it's it's supposed to be a tournament there is no tournament by the way it, it's it's portrayed as a tournament it's not a tournament in fact if uh what's what's the what's the actor's name that does shang Tsung? carrie tagawa if he wasn't in it if Robin Show wasn't in it, if Christopher Lambert wasn't riding, I'm not sure what the redeeming qualities are. You know a movie shit. Okay, let me let me. T this is how you know a movie franchise is is just completely off. When they tease the sequel at the end of the first movie, and then you go into the next movie, and literally half the cast has been changed. That's when you. That's a that's a huge red flag. And yet. Somehow, with the bar being so low, you know, one of the things I, I said, I said that on Twitter and some people were like, I don't know what you want, bro. It's a Mortal Kombat movie, dog. It's, I just want to watch fights and killing people. What I'm saying is, dude, it doesn't even satisfy on those. Is this supposed to be smoke? Who is this? <laughs> He's selling the punches, too. See, my, my thing is, the bar is so low and people want so badly to just See how old people, dog, old people, they just, they just, right. they're so, they just want to be contrary, you know? Me. I liked it, I thought it was fun. You know what pissed me off? That reptile fight. How do you have a rep, how do you have people gassing up that movie, and then the reptile fight happens? And I'm like, dude, what the fuck? And then the, 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 the Kano Cyclops, the Arcana shit, we're not even talking about the main, the made up, the main character, by the way. I mean, that shit was awful. How do you gas that up? That And you know, that's what pissed me off, man. Those pe The people that come in there and they're like, what do you want, man? It's just a more, it's an MK movie, man. Uh, what do you, what I want? I want it to be dumb and fun. Maybe have some cool fights. It didn't have any of that shit. That's my fucking point, asshole. So sorry, yeah. This dude steals the show, man. Honestly, they should put him in the new Mortal Kombat. They should just put him in there. Oh, speak of the fucking devil. It's Mortal Kombat. I will say that. I think the opening, the first 10 minutes, they they had me in there, you know? I was like, okay, okay, they trying to they trying to do something. And then they bring in this 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 cold, literally just a game FAQ self-insert character. And I'm like, okay, cool, I guess. What what do y'all remember the part of the movie? A hey, spoilers. Do y'all remember when they take Cole to the wherever they were going, the train or whatever? And then the riding was like, hey, by the way, you're not cut out for this shit. You're not built for this. And Cole was like, okay. And he just leaves. <laughs> y'all remember that? He's like, all right. He just dipped. <laughs> that was, and I was like, wait, what? 
<laughs> That's such a weird interact. Like, why? Why would you do that? Ryan's ex. Oh man, they should have just got Christopher Lambert back, man. And you know what? I know what his name is, Christopher Lambert. But you know, I got respect for him, so I put that French twang on it at the end. They should just—they should have just got him back. He—he he was a sick run. Even though he's probably one of the worst actors in that movie, but fuck it. Just, you know, just bring it back, dude. It'll make people happy. I forgot about Jax, bruh. What the fuck are those nasty robot T-Rex arms, bruh? If you're gonna, if you're gonna break his arms off and kick him down a, you know, dilapidated building, the least you could do is get some cool, you don't even have to reinvent the wheel. Just get the nasty, uh, you know, the big body chrome arms, like, like, he, like he's always had. Just get those. They, what is this nasty T-Rex baby arm shit, dude? He's he's mad old now, right? Carry Tagawa, but like, I think he could still do it. It's, the it's, it's such a hard performance to follow up, you know? Even in a shitty movie. The original is, that's the thing. I don't think the original is a good movie. Yeah, he did in the game, but I'm saying like on a big screen. It's not a good movie. When you go back and watch, I, like I watched it again recently. Yeah, combat. But he's Anyone he kills it. Yeah. I think that's pretty you know interesting. Is, Yo, BB bunch, Jack. I see you with the uh, seven, this bro. Shit finna get an Oscar nom. I mean, it, it's already got one in my book. It deserves one. Bro, Shao Kahn is acting his ass off. In the fight choreography, to me, top notch. I'm thinking the guy that plays Jack. My thing is, dude, the, the set design, the costume design. This feels more like an MK movie than the new one. Look at Kano's eyes. We don't talk about Annihilation. We don't, we don't, you know, Anni MK Annihilation, there was like a four or five year stretch where every day when I came home from like practice or school, it would be on one of the movie channels. So I've seen the part where so uh, Sonya and Jax are in the factory and they have to fight uh, Sector and, or, or is it Cyrax in there? And he self-destructs at the end. I've seen that part close to triple digits, I believe. I would just come home and that and that would be on the TV. I'm like, oh, okay. The green screen explode. Yeah, like they teleport out of the factory and just like just jump, like Michael Bay style explosion. Annihilation is great to laugh at. It's it's cool. It's cool up until people start transforming into dragons. Then you're like, oh, you know, like, this was fun. <laughs> Real shit. This might be this might be the greatest fight scene in Mortal Kombat cinema history. And look at the costume design. He's j he's jacked. He's bro. He's got the walk, the attitude. I mean, who would have thought duct tape as as the uh, as the robot arms? Somehow better than the 2021 T Rex uh T Rex Magic T Rex robot arms. And yet the duct tape somehow is better. <laughs> bro, they shoot. No pay is called. They, bro, they shot this shit with a drone. That's godlike. <laughs> they shot this shit with a drone. Look at the cinematography. Oh. That's all one shot. That's one shot. Let's go. Bro, God of Cinema is on fire, bro. They, don't, they just they don't give a shit. Oh, he doing strange. <laughs> They're doing strings true to the game. You see this? Bro, he got the idol stands down and everything. I love this shit. <laughs> this dude's doing strings. Wow. Oh, look at Sub Zero. Get him in. Get him in. Oh. <laughs> Imagine if these dudes had more than a $200 butt. That's what I'm Public Enemy. That's what I'm saying. How did these mother? Jenny, I'm gonna freeze you from zero point zero 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 zero. Any maguem? Ready? I don't want peace. I want problems always. 